Hey everyone, Harrison here from Audio Advice, and in this video, we're gonna be going over a list of carefully curated Dolby Atmos demo scenes that are sure to put your speakers to the test. Now, from heart-pumping action sequences to emotional dramatic moments, each scene has been chosen to fully showcase the power and depth of Dolby Atmos. Plus, some of the most well-respected influencers in the industry have added their favorite picks to the mix, giving us an even wider variety of exceptional scenes to enjoy. So buckle up and get ready for some demo scenes that will be sure to impress your friends and family next time you want to show off your system. Our first pick here at Audio Advice is Angel Has Fallen which is a riveting action thriller that follows the harrowing journey of a secret service agent who's been unjustly accused of attempting to assassinate the president. The movie's adrenaline-fueled plot features a gripping opening scene that will put your audio system to the test as the daring attack on the president is carried out by a swarm of menacing drones that create just a stunning soundscape. Now, as the drones whiz overhead and around you, the effects deliver an immersive experience that is really sure to leave you on the edge of your seat. The explosions that just rock the screen provide a breathtaking bass impact that is both intense and spectacular. And toward the end of the scene, there's a thrilling moment where the president and the Secret Service agent, they plunge into the depths of the water to evade a deadly drone bomb. Now the audio effects here truly shine as the surround sound, it just immerses you in this, this underwater world and you can almost feel the pressure of the water right on your ears. Now the explosion above is brilliantly recreated with your Atmos height effects, making you feel like you're right there with them, dodging the danger in a heart pumping sequence that is really sure to just leave you breathless. Next up, we have the opening chase scene in Six Underground, which is on Netflix. And this is just a tour de force of jaw dropping action and audio engineering that will really test your system. Now as this scene unfolds, you're thrust into a thrilling high speed car chase that races through the busy streets of Florence, Italy. Now the sound effects are expertly crafted to create an immersive experience that just transports you right into the heart of the action. You hear the roar of the engines, the screech of the tires, and the crash of the metal that are all expertly mixed to create this stunning and realistic soundscape in Dolby Atmos. Now what really just sets this scene apart, however, is those use of the Dolby Atmos height effects. As the chase hurdles through those narrow streets and alleys of Florence, you can just hear the sound of vehicles moving above you and around you, adding an incredible sense of verticality to the actual action. Now the use of Dolby Atmos technology is just truly impressive in this scene as it really creates a fully realized 3D sonic landscape that places you right at the center of the action. The result is an opening chase sequence that is just as thrilling to the ears as it is to the eyes and it sets the tone for the high octane action that is to follow in the movie. Now we want to give a huge shout out to all the creators that have given us the next picks and be sure to go subscribe to their channels as well. Now let's see what their favorite scenes are. I have two Dolby Atmos demos that I love sharing with friends and family as well as guests that come over to my home theater. The first one is from A Quiet Place. During both chapters 8 and 9 you can hear the monster in specific height channels. At one point she's down in the basement and you can hear the monster walking in the front left uh, height speaker and then later on you hear him in the back left as he's walking down the stairs you hear it pan around the room it's phenomenal and it's really done really, really well. There's some jump scares throughout the movie, but that scene is definitely one that is really great. It's got some really good low end extension as well. The second Dolby Atmos demo I love sharing is from Blade Runner 2049. Now this entire movie is a must for Dolby Atmos home theaters. It's a great demo. There's a ton, I mean a ton of LFE, some low frequency effects throughout the movie that'll really give your subwoofers a workout. But the very opening scene from the moment the movie begins, you are completely immersed in this world. The height channels are engaged. The music score literally surrounds you and immerses you. And just about any time that they're flying one of the spacecrafts, it adds this element of music that just wraps around you and really sucks you into this sci-fi world. All right, we are talking best Dolby Atmos scene, and the first movie that comes to mind is 300 on 4K disc. Now, they redid this in Atmos, and I gotta say, one scene? Oh, it's cutting the movie short. It's amazing pretty much all the way through, okay? First scene is this thunder strike that happens front height left 
all the way over your shoulder to surround back right. And it goes along with the Legendary Pictures logo. So the movie's only barely started and you get a taste of just how good the Atmos track is in 300. Now, of course, the main, main scene, I, if I had to like nail down one, would be the arrow scene. Or, well, it's the battle scene where they shoot all the arrows up into the sky and all the arrows are coming down on our Spartans. And you can hear everything from, you know, arrows whooshing by your ears, the ones that are hitting the shield, arrows landing in the sand. And then, of course, they're joking and they're like, how would you you had to say it? And they're all laughing and they're like, what? Yeah, you know, fight in the shade. So that was a great scene. Dolby Atmos, killer. On to the next one. We have Mission Impossible Fallout. Of course, I'm talking about the helicopter chase. And of course, the inevitable crash that happens as well. Atmos on fire in this scene. But of course, this is actually a great movie that has a lot of Atmos from scores to suspenseful music. Even when they're in the nightclub and stuff, you hear like, you know, that muffled echoey bass kicks coming through. It just uh, fills the room, your home theater room with the ambiance of what's happening in that scene. So another great movie with Atmos that's fully active. Of course, the helicopter chase uh, scene is probably going to be the highlight. Hi, I'm Gene De La Sala with Audioholics. Some of my favorite Dolby Atmos demo scenes, one of them being from a World War II picture called Unbroken. I absolutely love the scene when they're in the bomber and they're about to unleash their bombs and the latch gets stuck. Now, there's two things about this scene that are so impressive. One is the center channel dialogue. There's a lot of dialogue going on. And when all the sounds are hitting from the bullets ricocheting throughout the plane, you hear it from the sides, from above, and all around you. But at the same time, this is a great test for center channel intelligibility. And it lets you know just how good your center channel is. And of course, I love when they drop the bombs and you don't hear it actually impact until several seconds later. My second favorite demo scene is from the movie Ready Player One. This is an animated movie. It's got incredible visuals and audio. And when King Kong comes up through the city, I absolutely love that scene. I'm a huge fan of King Kong. And the amount of bass that comes out of that scene when he's banging on the buildings and he's stomping on the floor and you hear the the uh, racers collecting all the coins around you it's just so much to enjoy in that one moment it's a great test for your subwoofers i hope you guys enjoy both of these clips and these are excellent movies to watch but they're great to demo to really show off your dolby atmos system hey folks jeremy Pyle here from techthusiasm and i wanted to talk about a couple of my favorite dolby atmos scenes the Batman, yeah, the newer film, the car chase, highway chase scene. You got Batman tearing down the freeway in the Batmobile, chasing after the penguin, bombastic audio, workout for your entire system. Once the Batman finally hits the back of the penguin's car and he goes tumbling, that car goes rolling down. I think that's one of the coolest uses of the whole Dolby Atmos thing because you're the penguin there. You're sitting in that car and that sound is whooshing, whooshing and the breaking of the glass, the tinkling of all of the debris, you can hear it from your side surrounds up over top and around. Makes me wonder if the next speakers that we might be putting in our system will be in the floor so that we can get a full almost 360 degree rotation there. But I think that's a really, really key Atmos scene. If you've got a system that can show real, real great detail, you can hear that glass, you can hear that debris, and just a really, really awesome one to showcase the unique coolness of having a Dolby Atmos capable system. Another Dolby Atmos scene that I always put in my demos of my home theater when I have folks over is Gravity. Specifically, you got to make sure that you have the Dolby Atmos release of this film, of course. In the beginning, they're starting their mission. They're out there doing the spacewalk. Before the debris field comes and messes up the whole thing, there's a lot of chatter, mission control chatter, the astronauts talking to each other. And if you have a Dolby Atmos system with good placement of your speakers, great separation in all your channels and all of that, it's so cool how different elements of the communication of the astronauts comes all over the room, all from the different speakers, including the overheads. It gives you that feeling of weightlessness. It gives you that feeling of kind of like tumbling through space, this dialogue, this communication, everything all around. Really neat and a really great showcase, I think, for immersive audio 
and Dolby Atmos. What's going on everybody? This is Cody, the home theater hobbyist. First of all, I want to thank Audio Advice for giving me this opportunity to share just a couple of Dolby Atmos movies that I like to demo with my friends and family. And first of all, I want to start off with a movie that's just a few years old. It's called Midway, and it is about the battle between uh, the Americans and the Japanese at Midway in World War II. And right around the hour and 30 minute mark, the American pilots are coming in to bomb some of the Japanese ships. Well, of course, the Japanese don't want this to happen, so they are firing their big guns at the American pilots. So you get the bump, 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 bump from the guns and your subwoofers working, but you also get the sounds of the bullets whizzing by the pilot. So it's like all around, you got surrounds going, your rears are going, overheads going, fronts are going. It's just a great experience because you are in the cockpit with the pilot as these bullets are passing you. So it is a nice visceral experience in a great Dolby Atmos soundtrack because again you got overheads along with the surrounds. Now the next movie I want to talk about is Ford versus Ferrari. This movie is also just a couple of years old and this is a great movie overall. It's a great movie just to sit down and watch in my personal opinion even if you aren't into racing but the movie itself is about the battle between the Ford Motor Company and Ferrari in the 1960s to win the uh, 24 hours at Le Mans race and Right around an hour and 40, 45 minutes into the movie, it's the last and final race that you're going to see. And the racers are out there and they are racing. They're passing one another. So you get rear to front, you know, and you get all of these different changes. Some cars wrecked. There's a couple of explosions. There's just a lot going on. And even the soundtrack is very heart thumping. And it can really get you into being a driver in this race and really enjoying it. So even if the person doesn't necessarily like racing, I'm pretty sure this is a movie that they will enjoy. And it just does everything for you. So those are just a couple of recommendations that I have. Midway and Ford versus Ferrari. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to the Home Theater Hobbies channel. Also, audio advice if you have have not and um, yeah just have a great day thanks to everyone who gave us those awesome demo scenes now there's so many more great Dolby Atmos demo scenes that we didn't include in this video so if you're looking for more watch our prior video about our favorite Dolby Atmos movies that we will have linked in the description and if there are ones that we didn't mention please leave a comment of your favorite movie or scene that we can try out ourselves if you've enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up Hit that subscribe button, and while you're at it, we have linked everyone's YouTube channel that was featured in this video in the description below, so go give them a subscription too. Now thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.